Line. There's a line, there's a line, there's a line. This is a good sign, man. My name is Ro Vandal. I'm a 25 year old producer and DJ from Amsterdam. I love to have a good time, hang out with my friends, have some good food, skateboard. But most of all, I love to travel. A few years ago, I decided to leave the safe path. I quit my job, quit my school, and I started focusing on music for 100%. The best decision I made in my life. I started playing drums in the church band, and at the age of 16, my grandfather introduced me to music production. I just did it for myself, and it just felt good to make music. Whenever I went out with my friends to a party, and the DJ was killing it. I was just amazed by how the DJ could move the crowd and how everybody went nuts by his tracks and the way he mixes. And I was like, yo, maybe I can do that too. Like playing a set to me is like flying an airplane. You gotta make the airplane fly, keep it up and land it safely. Like you cannot crash, you cannot bring down the energy, you cannot make bad mixes, you gotta be on point. I never thought I would end up being a producer and DJ, but I'm very humbled to be able to travel the world because of my music. Sometimes it almost feels like uh, the more I travel, the more I grow as a person, and that's because I go through stuff that I wouldn't go through in my own comfort zone or in my own city. Time differences, late set times, early checkouts, because the one moment you're in a busy club with people around you that talk to you, that go crazy to your music and the next moment you're in your hotel room by yourself with no family or friends around you. Vandalized edits are like an alter ego to Juro Vandal. The very first vandalized edit I made was an edit of Muramasa's Lotus Eater. I played this very big show on a big festival and I wanted to do something special so I decided to make an edit of it and when I played it the crowd went nuts. <laughs> three times and after a bunch of shows I had collected 25 of those edits which I released online under the name Vandalize Edits Volume 1 just for the club, for my DJs and for the club culture. 